Hey, it's Dr. E with TheManualTherapist.com. So here are three ways to self-treat your headaches. And uh, I teach patients these after I do various manual therapy and soft tissue techniques to their upper cervical spine, upper thoracic spine, and cervical spine because they need to be able to lock it in. So even if your techniques are making someone feel better, they need to be able to help themselves at home. And these techniques in particular, I, I instruct for when they have a flare-up because they will have a flare-up without you as a clinician. So the first one is a just a prolonged retraction, and they can do this in supine. So if they're relying supine, they may, might do it over heat or ice here in their cervical spine, and they're just going to hold the retraction, but also making sure that the shoulders are down and relaxed and they're still diaphragmatically breathing. They're going to hold the retraction for up to two or three minutes. And the two or three minutes uh, is what McKenzie teaches as uh, derangement because headache it falls into the derangement category, meaning that the rapid onset should be rapid resolution. So if someone holds the upper cervical spine open for two or three minutes, they get resolution, great. And again, like I said, you can ice or heat the neck as appropriate. Uh, if that helps, but it doesn't quite fully abolish it or it doesn't help at all, you can try this. I teach the patients how to find their C2. So the first spinous process, right below the occiput, the first bump, they're going to put a finger or index finger on either side of the spinous process. They're going to hold the retraction. So they're going to retract and they're going to just push lightly forward. So hold the retraction, push forward, P to A, just pressure on, pressure off, they can do this for about two or three minutes, they can do it sitting upright, or they could do it in a, preferably in a non-weight bearing position, again they can do that over heat or ice. The last one is a self-prolonged cervical retraction with an overpressure. So if someone was, again, lying down, or they were even in, say, a car seat or a high, high seat um, that supported their head and neck, they're going to retract, and similar to the subcranial shear distraction or the skull pressure, what they're going to do is just apply pressure, or they, or they can get someone else to apply pressure with two hands to do that A to P shear through the frontal cranium. So hold the retraction and push which would just give further pressure to the end range of upper cervical retraction. So when someone has a flare-up, I instruct one of those three things, and typically they won't need you. And if they don't need you, they'll be happier. But, um, you know, uh, on, the, uh, on the other hand, um, if that doesn't help get rid of the headache within a day or even within a few hours, I do tell them to come in right away. All right? Those are some headache tips from the manual therapist.com.